know, if I were to close my eyes and think about summer, I feel like I see the breeze, I see wildflowers, I see water, I see a lot of blue and a lot of green. And I think that's what inspired us for the cover, just being in a field where it was very minimal. For summer, we just felt like freedom was the theme that just felt right. From a literal standpoint, freedom and just schedules, you know, for kids, it's freedom, they're out of school. But then on a deeper level, knowing that freedom is really subjective, it looks different for all of us. For me now, um, I think what I loved about this topic, freedom, it really challenged me and the whole team, all of us, to kind of look into our own lives and really examine, hey, wh what are we needing to find freedom from? And for some people, freedom can mean a yes and being brave and going for something. And then on the other side, freedom means um, saying no to something and so we really wanted to leave that open for people so that when they were reading the journal or if they stepped into the shop that it was open enough to inspire them what our hope is is that they walk out and they really search for that in their own lives You know, these installs are always so fun because I feel like it's like this challenge. The store shuts down at 6, at 6.15, everything starts coming down. We start moving the old stuff out, new stuff in, and I mean, I'm talking a lot of hands on deck. I love these kind of days where we're all just being intentional about it. I think the, the heart and the soul and the meaning behind this stuff, the team doesn't take that lightly. And so when you see it go up, I really feel like people are going to feel the intentionality behind it. Oh, look at the ivy girls. Look at that teepee with the ivy on it. Oh, mug. Wow. So this teepee is awesome. It's huge. Um, what I love about this display is the team was really intentional about the idea of freedom, even in the smallest of details. So the big picture of this, yeah, you've got this cool teepee that's covered in these handmade fig ivies. But when you really look down to every detail, every little leaf, you'll see that with this watercolor, every leaf took on its own form. So every one of them is unique. Every one of them is different. And what I love about that is even in the smallest of details, you can really see just the art form, that freedom, you can see that uh, being tied into all of it. Wildflowers, to me, you know, they are the most free. They grow where they want to grow. They grow when they want to grow. Um, and I feel like that's just a picture of summer. So we wanted that throughout the shop. Rebecca is finishing up um, this watercolor here. She's painting the edges. She's my watercolor teacher. She's so patient with me. She's taught me a lot about this art form. When they came up with the idea of this, I just loved the concept. I loved um, taking the inspiration from the cover of the magazine, putting it out as a watercolor, but I love it. It looks amazing. And then over here, the wow wall. What I love about this is you have the cutouts of the birds and it's like they've found their freedom in this journey and now they're going. They're, I don't know, for me it, it speaks volumes just kind of in my own life about how sometimes it's just about breaking through, um, 
being free, whatever that may be, big or small. I don't know, I think there's something about it that feels really, it warms my heart. Oh, my trick, dip it. It's gone. That's a mean trick. There were brownies. Oh, back to work. Okay, so fun fact about the summer issue is this was shot in the front yard at the farm. Um, and I wanted to be in a red dress. Typically, I like wearing black, white, denim, and every now and then, khaki. Um, red is a stretch. So I thought for the freedom issue, for the summer issue, I will go bold, I will wear red. So I wore red and I wore mustard yellow shoes. So, I don't know, I think it's fun. I think, um, you know, Chip loves seeing me in a red dress. That's always been his dream. That's, that's the only time you'll ever see me in a red dress, people, right there. Do you see these? Look. Be gentle, gentle. I'm gonna, we can't take any more down. They worked real hard on that. In the summer more than ever I feel the most challenged to just kind of step back and and be childlike again be childlike with my kids be childlike just with my own heart and mind in that I want to be brave I want to be adventurous I want to um, still think of ways to stay curious and so hopefully you know whether you read the magazine or you step in the shop hopefully these simple things that you see throughout will help inspire that in your own life <laughs>